Hey guys, it's me, it's me, the Nintendo Swing Man here, welcome you back to more Let's Play Pokemon Stadium 2 in the last episode, episode... We're gonna do, we're gonna do pretty great with this on Poke Cup. Let me look at this, we have battle, uh, we're just gonna be battle number 6, we have 4 continues, we have 2 more battles left. I've been doing pretty good, my team's doing pretty well, so this is, this is the last 2 battles, we're gonna continue and end this Poke Cup strong. So let's do this. Hopefully this battle doesn't take like 10 years though. It's a snowboarder or something. Alright, I'm gonna freeze your Pokemon solid, man. No you're not. No you're not. Oh, freeze my Pokemon with technically two ice types. Eh, you can save a part from before, I don't know. Whatever. But we have... Oh god. Alright, um... Truth be told, I actually had a failed recording of this. <laughs> Um, that Taurus. Yeah, that Taurus. Pretty powerful. Um, we got Delibird, which is weak as heck, so I don't worry about that. Sneasel. Dark Ice type, so. Yeah, pretty powerful there. Um, Tentacruel. Taurus, yeah, it's, that's. Uh, um, Vaporeon, a Teddy Ursa. What are you gonna do with a Teddy Ursa? Oh. I don't know. Well, let's see. Four of his Pokemon are weak against fighting, so I mean, Paracross has got to be in that one. Now let's see. Um, I'm tempted to use Alakazam, but we all know that he doesn't know Psy Psybeam, so I don't like that. And. Maybe Anthros, but the thing is, like I said, it only knows, um, um, Zap Cannon, and we all know how great Zap Cannon is, but, uh, it is powerful. Um, so we got Heracross, oh man. This is a, okay, Heracross, Vaporeon, Ah, I might as well go for it, Amphi. Let's do it. Let's just do it. Let's go. Semi-finals. Semi Here we go. Alright, we got Heracross versus... Ooh, great matchup. Sneasel, the Ice Dark type from Gen 2. I'm gonna go for a reverse. Hopefully this thing just go like hacks slash attack. Yay! Alright, yes. Sneasel has a very, very high attack ratio, but good thing Reversal does more damage to less than health I have, so that should knock it out. Thank you, Sneasel. You actually helped me there. Lost the edge there? Oh yeah, you lost the edge. They're losing the edge right now. They're losing it. We got Taurus. Oh god, here's the problem, child. Here, Taurus is very powerful. Normal type. I have to hope that I can survive whatever the heck this guy has and get a reversal. That's my only hope. This seems gonna be faster than me. Yeah, this might be over. Watch how strong this is gonna be. Oh, I survived. Do it, man. This is perfect. Do it. Reversal. Get it. Nice. This should knock him out in one hit. And look at Heracross knock it out. Pokemon like it's no one's business. Only has 29 HP though, so I kind of hope he's faster than this last Pokemon, which is Vaporeon, the defensive water type. I don't think I'm faster than this guy, but we're gonna, we're gonna try for a reversal. Oh, I'm faster! Come on, Heracross! Come on, can you take out the entire team? Can you do it? Oh, oh man, so close. Wait, 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 dude, this actually missed, this missed. Okay. I thought we missed because I'm port fighting, but whatever. Heracross did amazing. He took out two Pokemon single-handedly. Kudos to Heracross. That so, I got I'm gonna grant Ampharos, even though this is the wrong Pokemon choice. You'll see, you'll, you probably know why. Oh, it's Ampharos. What Ampharos? It's Ampharos. Ampharos. That's <laughs> interesting pronunciation here. The tenth battle continues. Yeah. Zap Cannon. Great. Great. 
I'm gonna flinch too, aren't I? Just watch. What do you want a critical from that? Okay, gotta hit this man. Zap cannon! Yes! He got it! The curse of the Zap Cannon is over! Ah, total wipe out. Nice save, Amphilos. Nice save. You're back in my good graces. We did lose Heracross, but Amphro saved the end, and Heracross was amazing, so. <laughs> These things happen. Yes, they do. They, they happen, you know. But guess what? We got the Glacier Badge. One more badge left, the Rising Badge. Wow, this means at five minutes. Jeez. Okay, before it continues, we're going on. We're we, we going on. Oh, I don't know what I'm saying. There, we're going on to the final. So let's continue and hope I don't have to reuse all four continues on this. Oh, we got a psychic, it seems. Let me look into your soul. What? Defeat me? It's madness! Oh, great. Alright. Oh, dear. It's that Nat 2, yes. I actually did make it to the finals in my favorite recording, and that Nat 2 is stronger than it looks. It really is. Um. Alright, so... Uh, wait, what? <clears throat> He's a psychic, and he only has two psychic Pokemon. I don't think they're really understanding their class. You know, you're a psychic. You should specialize in psychic Pokemon. You shouldn't have... Smeargle, really? Okay, well, enough of my shocking accusation. I don't know. Well, let's see. My really only my my really only hope. I'm speaking weird. Is that this guy does not use Slowpoke because I'm starting off with the great Steelix. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's gonna just shield everything for me. Um. Then um. Vaporeon, actually, because it's insane amounts of health. And... Uh, I'm thinking between Ampharos and Dragonite, actually. Dragonite, well, it does not have the best moveset. It is still fairly powerful. <clears throat> and Ampharos, all it has is just Zap Cannon. Hey. Yeah. Um... I really don't know, guys. Ampharos or Dragonite? I think... I'm gonna go... Oh, I'm gonna regret this. I gotta go Ampharos. I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm gonna regret this, but I'm gonna I'm going to Ampharos. That's why it took a while there, guys. This is a final battle. Like, I really think about my team. My final team. Let's do this. We got Steelix! The great and powerful Steelix! Oh, Steelix versus Nat 2. Yeah, you're going down, Nat 2. Nat 2, the psychic flying Pokemon from Gen 2. Actually, this is the guy that single handedly took out my entire team in my failed recording. I am not kidding you. He single handedly okay. took out. Because of that, Confuse Ray. A flash of Confuse Ray! He took out my entire team with Confuse Ray. I'm not even joking. All right, we gotta we gotta focus. Yes, we got a rock throw. That's good. Good start. Good start. Nice job, Steelix. Good start so far. And guess what? It used a gold berry to restore its HP. We're gonna continue this now. What did he do next? He did some stupid move next that really just caused my Pokemon? Yeah, Nightshade. Yeah, it was mixture of confusion and Nightshade. He took out my entire team with that. As you know, Nightshade does damage equivalent to the level of Poke. Oh, I'm still hitting. That's great. The level of Pokemon to use it. So, 52 damage it does because Natu is level 52. Alright, can we do this? Let me take out this Natu. Can we snap out of confusion? Can we do this? Because this is not going to knock me out. Okay, you got to do this, Steelix. Yes! We got rid of that Natu. Hit him. Nice! Alright, Steelix. The great and powerful Steelix has started off strong. That's <laughs> all I have to say. Hi. Huh. <laughs> Alright. Oh, wow. I'm, so, I'm pumped here. This is great. This is... Oh, it's oh God. It's Clefable! The, um, normal type. And now, apparently, in the X and Y series, Berry type. 
Yes, it's gained the fairy type ability or a uh, typeage now. I don't know what fair I don't know too much about the fairy type, but yes, it is now a fairy type in the generations now. But now here in this game it's just normal type. The fairy the fable each other is known for its move Metronome. It can choose any move from the entirety of Pokemon, basically, of this generation and past. Um, that makes this thing pretty difficult to deal with, actually. However, also, this guy can know um, various elemental moves. The trainer hasn't issued a I'll show you what I mean soon, if it does, like, Surf or something. Or Ice Punch. Or... It knows Ice Punch. Now let tap. Oh, it's knocked me out, though. Let's see if I can get this Iron Tail. That'd be nice. What Hit it! Bam! Hit. That, is like yeah, that was dead. good, that was good, and Man, yeah, that's nice. That well, Steelix is gonna lose this one, I can tell you that right now, but we got his eight speed um, down pretty significantly, that's good. There. Great job, Steelix, though, you did amazing. You really did great, I'm proud of you. So, we're tied two to two. It knows ice. I don't know if this thing knows Thunder Punch. So, unfortunately, though, these are physical attacks. I'm just one wondering to use Vaporeon. Because Vaporeon is my most defensive Pokemon. Ampharos doesn't have Rainer defense worth anything. Um, but if I could hit Zap Can, it would be amazing. Alright, I'm going to go Vaporeon, actually. I trust Vaporeon. Ready to go. All right, Vaporeon. I know this thing knows the electric type move, but Vaporeon's my best chance here. I'm going to go Waterfall, so much that goes. Who's faster? Yeah, it knows something. It's faster. That's great. Aw, oh, dang it. No. Come on. Snap out of it. Yes. Come on, Waterfall. Ah, nice. All right. If we can just survive one more Thunder Punch and a Paralysis thing, we can get this. I believe in Vaporeon. I believe in you. Hang in there, Vaporeon. Let's hit. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes! Can we knock it out, though? Can we do it? Waterfall! We did it! Vaporeon has done it. He's defeated Clefable. This sleep's only one Pokemon left. Can we do this? The paralyzed Vaporeon versus... Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Really? <laughs> Growl with the Fire-type Pokemon from Gen 1. This is the perfect match for I'm paralyzed. Are you serious? Dang it. Okay, Growl is known for its speed and somewhat its special attack. I'm going to have to hope this thing doesn't knock Vaporeon out with, what, like, a quick attack or something. And it just gets, like, paralyzed. Hacked. We're going to go for a waterfall. What is it? Oh, no, it's using Dig. Or is it? Oh, um, you little. Oh, well, that was actually probably a good thing for me. All right, we're going to switch out because... Um, oh, oh, this guy may get may have gotten me. Wait, maybe not. I'm going to take a chance. I know it's going to be super effective, but may not be do, may not do that much damage because Dig is actually pretty good. I'm switching out to Amphros. It's really my only choice. I don't want to lose Vaporeon. Ampharos has its killer move, but it has to hit it. Alright, hang in there, Ampharos. Nice. That's hanging. Okay, I think we'd be fine with this. Alright, Ampharos, I need you to use Zap Cannon. We have to hit. I don't think we're attached. Oh, let's use. Oh, this might be a problem. <clears throat> Can we survive it? Oh, it was good. Okay, we got this, Ampharos. Zap Cannon! I need you to hit it now. Oh my god, man! I needed you to hit it! I'll give you one last chance. Why isn't he using Dig? Doesn't make sense. Does survive this, please. Dang it, Ampharos! Ugh. Dang it! Oh man. This is not going well. He has one, one Pokemon remaining. The, really, the pair. Oh, They're ready to go. Man. Do not end it like this. Vaporeon, you have now. to hit this waterfall and survive the his attack. You've got to. Continue. This is your last shot. This is the final. Let's do Let's this. Get, ready to go. get in gear. Swift. What is this? 
All right, let's do this, Vaporin. Waterfall. Waterfall. Yes! Can we get a one-hit KO here? Can Vaporin do it? Can this be an upset? It's an upset! And look at that, Vaporeon, paralyzed Vaporeon, with 52 health left, has won us, the Poke Cup. Nice job, Vaporeon. That was a tough psychic, but Vaporeon just was able to stay hang in there. I never predicted I would lose. Is it impossible to see one's own fate? I probably could say that. But we got the Rising Badge, and you know what that means, guys. Heracross. You did great, guy. You, you really pulled it through the end. Vaporeon! You won it for me! The great Steelix, the defensive tank. Ampharos, you, you got back in there with that zap cannon. Alakazam, I wish you knew Psychic. And Dragonite. Good job. <laughs> and that is, ooh, Nintendo. The Poke Cup. Clear. Yes. All right, so you know what that means, guys. We got one last cup left here. That's the Prime Cup. However, I'm actually not going to do the Prime Cup just... Well, actually, yes, I'm going to do the Prime Cup next. What am I talking about? I'm going to save the Challenge Cup for something later, because I don't. you can't actually choose a team for me. It chooses it for me. I don't know. But yes, the Prime Cup is next here. I'm actually going to start it slightly. And so we are, you know, most likely going to do rentals. And yes, basically the Prime Cup, all Pokemon are level 100. <laughs> you get to use just about anything. We've got legendaries here. We got just about all evolutions and stuff. Yeah. So once again, you choose my team for the Prime Cup. I know it's been a long video, but I just wanted to just reiterate this again. Um, once again, I'll put the list of Pokemon in the description. So you can look down there and see what I, we got. We got Blissey. Look at that Blissey. Blissey. Yay. But yeah, choose whatever t Caterpie. If you choose a Caterpie for me, I will never forgive you. No, I'm kidding. That might be an interesting challenge though. But yeah, any one of these Pokemon are fair game. Any one. You got an Entei. Let me use Legendaries. Go right ahead. So. Yeah, next time on Let's Play Pokemon Stadium 2, I will pick the winning team, like I always do. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode. I sure did. Great Ampharos, I love it. So, actually, yeah. So, um, it's been me. Actually, you know what? On second thought, I'll have you choose my team for the Gym Leader Challenge, because uh, someone commented. It's been a long video, but someone commented, which of the core said, it would be interesting if I used my um, Pokemon Gold team. And I'm actually strongly considering doing that. So, actually, for the first time, next time on Let's Play Pokemon Stadium 2, I will actually choose my Go Pokemon Gold team to battle. And I'll have you choose my team for the Gym Leader Cup instead. I'm sorry, but I, I think it would be an interesting challenge for me. See how well they do. So, yes. I hope you guys enjoyed. I sure did. It's been me. It's me, the Nintendo Sway Man, signing off. And I will see you guys in the Prime Cup. See you later.